Hi guys, another video today. I'm gonna show you today how to drain the air tanks, uh, especially I told you in the winter we have to drain them pretty often, make sure we don't have moisture inside the lines to get ice. Uh, the best way to do it is in a day that's sunny and warm, that the temperature is a little bit higher than freezing, 34 or higher, so let's start to look for it. First of all, everything is on this side, and if you remember how to take those off, with twist 90 degrees, you have a twist, pull down, everything comes down. While I'm here, I want to make sure I remind everyone, if we have that main switch that we keep talking about to cut the power on a whole truck, that switch is located right on top of the batteries. You see it up here. You see what I turn it off? Has a little hole in there. That hole will tell you position that's in. It says on up there and off down here. So I'm turning back in an on position and that's how we take the power off of the whole truck for make sure we don't drain the battery. If you see the truck for more than a week, I recommend everybody to turn that power switch off to make sure we conserve the batteries. Uh, any other important part is while we're here, uh, make sure we have those problems with the battery getting loose. Those are the terminals that I'm talking about. There's, uh, there's four batteries, one, two, three, four. They all, those terminals need to be tight. Even hand tight will help. You'll, you'll figure out when you move on one of those cables, they see the cables is loose. We know we have a loose connection. But again, we go back to the purpose we're here for. Uh, air tanks. The air tanks are three air tanks. They're all located underneath the batteries and that's what we're looking for here. We try to drain those air from the tanks to make sure it doesn't form ice in it. So the best thing to do and the way to do it is reach to this cable on top here on top of the on the left side of the, the batteries and just pull on it. Just a simple and that's, that's, that's the noise you'll hear. Well, the noise that you hear is actually air draining out of the tanks. They drain all in the same time. They're gonna drain, drain it all the way down. Make sure you'll see many times you'll see water coming underneath the trucks. That doesn't mean you have moisture in the tanks and now you drain it and when it's gonna froze, we're not gonna have uh, forming ice on it. So this is pretty much the purpose of the video today. Uh, anybody has any question, you can call me directly. Uh, make sure you follow the steps back. Make sure when you close the, the side skirt, make sure you push it all the way in. It's pushed all the way in and again, it be twisted 90 degrees, twist it straight, twist it straight. If you have hard time like here, it doesn't go in, you, you're not on the hole that, that, that has to, to lock in. So you push it deeper and we're gonna go in. They're secure, make sure everything is secure. Thank you very much.